When Canva had a data breach in 2019, hackers scattered away with data of about 136 million users. She was one of them. Hello! Welcome to CyberSafe with CCNet, where I tell stories and help you understand cyber hygiene best practices in the most relatable way possible. My name is Confidence Davey, aka CCNet. In today's video, I'll be discussing how to check if your personal data has been compromised. And if you haven't already subscribed to this channel, please click the subscribe button now for more videos. Data is power, and just like everyone else, hackers want power. Hackers gather data through several means, one of which is data breaches. And many organizations have suffered data leaks this year, some even more than once. Are you thinking, how is this my business? Well, let me tell you a story. My friend, Ms. D, loves social media a lot and was quite popular. The aesthetics of her page was really important to her, so she downloaded the Canva app and started creating her own graphics. Ms. D was doing great at many things, but maintaining good cyber hygiene wasn't one of them. When Canva had a data breach in 2019, hackers scattered away with data of about 136 million users. She was one of them. So, she got a mail informing her to change her password due to the data breach. Sadly, she ignored it. Now, months after that, Ms. D was trending on Twitter. Why? Her nude pictures had just been released to the public. It made no sense to her how they got the pictures out. So, here's what happened. Ms. D's Canva details, or login credentials as we call it, were among those stolen and sold on the dark web by hackers. So it was easy to gain access to other platforms belonging to Ms. D because she used a uniform password for all her platforms. Her Google Drive was compromised and that was how the hacker got the new images out. To be honest, at that point she had several regrets including using the same password across more than one platform and not taking action once she got the message from Canva. Now, data breaches, no matter how unimportant they may seem to you, could have a lasting effect on other areas of your life. Are you wondering at this point if you've ever been affected by data breach? Let's find out together by following these four simple steps. 1. Visit www.haveibeenporn.com 2. Impute your email address in the text box 3. Click Pond 4. Wait for the results if the results show that you have been involved in a data breach, please do the following. 1. Change your password to the affected account immediately. 2. Ensure you don't use that same password anywhere else. And 3. Turn on two-factor authentication across all your accounts. And then 4. Always perform routine checks to ensure you haven't been pawned. Do the results say you're safe? Keep up the good work! by using a strong password, which you should change regularly. And of course, turning on two-factor authentication and carrying out routine checks to find out if you have been pawned, like we just did. You can't be 100% safe from cyber attacks. Just ensure you are not the low-hanging fruit for hackers. Make you no go for my girl.